Wow. Oh. Sorry, guys. Cue the music. What's up everybody and welcome to Real Time for the real everyday movie fan. I am of course Josh Williams. Thank you so much for joining me here today. Because I am giving you my real time review of Avengers Endgame. Now Avengers Endgame was written, or sorry, it was uh, directed by the Russo brothers. And stars just a ton of people. A ton of people. And you guys know who they all are, especially if you've been following this franchise for 11 years now, 22 films in. So we'll kind of just gloss over that one. I'll put them all in the description box below. Just got out, if you can't tell, <laughs> just got out of Avengers Endgame. And wow, I, I, I'm feeling so many emotions now. You know, we I can't necessarily, there's no way to really talk about or review this movie without you know spoilers so with my non with this non-spoiler review all i can do is really talk about how i feel how i'm what i'm feeling right now like what you know i don't know just yeah that's the only thing i can really talk about right now because i don't want to give anything away from you guys you know to me any of you guys watching this review who haven't seen it yet uh me and ryan ryan's coming down for uh, this weekend we're gonna do our spoiler review on have it up on sunday it gives people plenty of time to see it that way you can watch it and then follow us for the spoiler review. But let's before we get into that, let's, let's get into this. But before we do, guys, please be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell so you receive more of our various content in the future. All right, we got that out the way. Whew. Okay, so this movie, it's amazing. It's, it's in my opinion, pure perfection i mean i've always said when a movie can make you laugh cry and cheer or, or all three in the same in the same scene or the same setting you know it's something special and there's sometimes where movies will do that in one or two parts of a film but this movie gives it to you the entire ride this movie is an epic i you know you call me crazy all you want i don't care this movie for me is getting a 10 out of 10 this it's just uh, it's amazing i mean there's there's so many parts that you're just you're you're so enthralled in the story like i don't know how the writers were able to do what they were able to do or even the russo brothers and kevin feige putting together this movie that just wraps it up in this perfect bow of this entire infinity war saga to have it end the way it did to have certain things happen the way they do certain decisions that people make the way they do that kind of just wrap up this you know these story arcs and not just for the story arc of the infinity saga itself but with the characters like the the, the main it really it really hardcore focuses on the main characters and what a way they and how they developed them how they you know worked in their storylines how they how they you know how their character arcs gotten even bigger it just it blew me away and it, it moved me it made me cheer it made me happy it, just, it like i said it, it's it's crazy it, it, and i knew going into this that there was gonna be a lot of shoes to fill for infinity war because to me it, infinity war was almost a perfect 10 film it was just a minor problem that was it that was all but this one it was able to do everything in in spades and like i said it's so hard to talk about how vague these things are because i don't want to give anything away but it just it blows my mind and it's 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 such an epic in a way that with infinity war it was very action-packed all the time this one it really takes us time to tell its story now you also get some great action in the film throughout 
but it just it's so good at making this movie making this story so dramatic and even in expanding upon I don't want I want to be vague here but it really even expands upon the prior movies themselves or the prior like you you learn more information you know through various situations and it's amazing like it, it's so cool how you're how it's able to expand upon the mythology of the mcu of this infinity war saga even more it's 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 insane it's so awesome now i will say I, I, for me I, I can't find anything else about it because for me yes the you guess you could say the pacing was a bit slower in the beginning but on purpose it, it needed to be able to tell this story which led up to the last hour. Now you probably heard some reviewers talking about the last hour is amazing. That it's just the most crazy thing you've ever seen, and they're right. I mean, it's. I almost thought my heart couldn't take it. Like it was so heart pumping, and you were, you were cheering. You were. I'm. Mean, I almost. I was. I would have been the only one in my theater, but um, in this in this crowd packed theater, I probably would have stood up on my feet and cheering. And it's just. It was so fucking awesome. One of the greatest moments, if not three, the greatest hours of action in cinematic history. It just, it's a geek fest. You will just, your mind will literally be on the floor. Now, I said before, if Infinity War blew my brains out and put it, splat it all over the floor, Endgame literally exploded my body or just did like the face melting thing from Raiders of the Lost Ark afterwards. It was just like you may also remember that scene from the Big Bang Theory where after they watched the Force Awakens, they're all just kind of sitting back in their chair, just like. I don't think I can walk right now. Yeah, that moment was just, it, it made me feel like that. It just, oh my gosh. Of course, you can see, I can highly recommend this, guys. I'm probably, you guys get to the theaters, run to the theaters. Even if you're just a casual fan who've only watched a couple of them here and there, haven't even kept up with them entirely, go see the movie. It is so worth it. You get so much out of it and so much enjoyment out of it. I got Me and my wife went and saw it. My wife went with me to see it. And she even liked it. She I mean, she only really likes like the Guardian movies mostly. And she found so much love. She had a lot of fun. And just, it's a great movie to take the kids. It's a great movie for the family. It's a great movie if you're just a fan of this in general. Or just great sci-fi action movies or comic book movies. Doesn't matter. This movie gives you everything. Everything you've ever wanted in a blockbuster movie. In a movie with heart and soul and story. It gives it to you all. And to me, this will go down as... I don't, it might go down as one of the greatest, or if not the greatest, comic book movie of all time, and it's going up there against the Dark Knight. I'm telling you, it is amazing. There's a, it's a battle right now between those two. It's a, it's an easy, it's a very strong battle between which one is the absolute best. Go see it. You will not be disappointed. I guarantee it. I'm gonna be seeing it about three or four more times. But that'll be today. That will do it for me today, folks. Thank you very much for watching. What did you think of Avengers Endgame? If you have seen it, no spoilers, guys. We'll save that for the spoiler review. Leave your comments section below. Give me your score out of 10. And just give me what you're feeling about it. What you felt leaving the theater. I guess that's the only way you could actually give me your thoughts without spoiling anything. But leave those in the comments section below. Also, if you like what you watch, hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel so you can receive more of our various content in the future. Also, like us on Facebook, Twitter, and Stardust. The links are in the description below, as always. That's all I have for today. Again, I'm Josh Williams, and thank you for keeping it real with Real Time. Oh.